Hey guys, Caleb's Cards here. Coming at you with another episode today. Recapping yesterday's for Wednesday and today's now Thursday. Uh, TTM's had one come in on Wednesday, which was a really nice one. And uh, four for today. So, uh, pretty decent mail nowadays for the past two days. Um, first, you guys have probably seen this before. Not too long ago, we got the. Uh, Alan sort of signed the photo and uh, got his brother Bobby to sign. Uh, he signed blue on blue, so it is kind of hard to see, but I promise you it is there, uh, just above his hand there. Uh, but got dual signed. Uh, two racing brothers right there, and uh, Bobby also included a signed card. Unfortunately, it did get smudged, especially on the last name, but uh, not a big deal. It was you know, it was free, and he included it. Um, so. I'll still keep it. Uh, and the four that came in today. So uh, we have two of two from Damon Heward. I believe he has a. I think his brother is Brock Heward, I want to say. Uh, he put together a pretty decent career as a backup quarterback uh, for uh, plenty of teams for quite a long while. Uh, was a decent college quarterback. So I got him in his college uniform there. Uh, thought this was an interesting photo uh, there with uh, Tom Brady obviously he won't dual sign that but uh, not that I'd want Tom Brady's signature anyways <laughs> uh, I admit as a Broncos fan he is certainly a great quarterback and will go down as one of the greatest but I just cannot stand his attitude so I don't want his autograph don't even have any cards of him well, I used to but I think they'll Sold on my collection a long time ago. Not autograph collection, just sports car collection. I uh, got former tight end the Philadelphia Eagles. He played for them for quite a while. Chad Lewis. Fortunately, got bent in the mail, but this is a, still a really nice photo. I uh, don't know who number 58 of the Giants is right there. If I could figure that out, then see if he signs and send the dual sign. That'd be really cool. But there's a signature. So got a touchdown catch right there. I thought that was a really nice shot. In case you're wondering, I get my photos from Pinterest, and sometimes Google, it depends. Um, don't know what happened here, it looked like something got spilled. Uh, Janet Evans, oh, maybe got, it must have gotten wet, I don't know, wasn't like that when I sent it, but uh, she signed this 4x6, uh, 4 time Olympic gold winner. Um, I sent her a American Heroes autograph signature card. Uh, still have yet to get it back, so I figured it's all she's signing. Print up a picture and uh, send it to her. So, again, don't just notice that too. I wasn't even paying attention. I don't know what happened there. So, water stain. Hmm. Maybe something happened at Walmart. <laughs> I don't know when I ordered my photos and didn't even pay attention. And finally, got an email success. 8x10 by Phil Martelli. This also got bent in half. Uh, St. Joseph's University. Certainly not auto pen though. So pretty cool. I think uh, he just signed a stack of photos. There's a signature that looks legit. And then obviously the Caleb best wishes part is different handwriting. So it's not him. Most coaches aren't going to have time to be able to do that. But uh, still a nice eight by ten. Was free his email. So and I always make sure to thank him with a uh, thank you email back. Uh, and time to get some back. I think that uh, helps you guys out later. You know, that there's, that, you know, somebody's thankful for what they're doing, and uh, maybe they want to keep doing the free emails. So that's my mail day today, guys. A lot of damages, but oh well, I'll still take it. Um, that's it, guys. So uh, hopefully we'll be back with some more tomorrow.